We all know that Sylvester Stallone has a real problem with the current producers and the, the owners of the rights of the Rocky franchise and made that feud very, very public. But while that was going on, a report came out that the producers of the Rocky franchise and the Creed franchise were looking at developing a Drago movie centered around Dolph Lundgren and his son, Florian, I never knew how to pronounce his last name, but he was also in Shang-Chi. Dude's a monster. Dude's a beast. Anyway. And then, I, you know, I guess Sylvester Stallone had some words about that. And then Dolph Lundgren got on social media and said, whoa, whoa, whoa. I had no idea there was any problems there. I just assumed Sly was on board with this, blah, blah, blah. Well, a lot of time has passed. And now Dolph Lundgren is saying that Drago movie that we all kind of wrote off may actually still be coming. This comes from some of the folks over at Coming Soon who wrote the following. Dolph Lundgren said about the movie. MGM was developing the script called Drago about my character and my son. I think what happened was the studio changed leadership and then Creed 3 did very well. So they just started preparing for Creed 4. This is last year. And then now there was a problem with a co-star in Creed 4. We all know what that is. Mm -hmm. uh, that storyline they had on the Drago script was interesting. It was kind of a coming to America kind of immigration angle with me and the son, and it was pretty cool. You know, he goes on to talk about the fact that one of the ideas they pitched to him was that at the beginning of Creed II, that him and his son are actually in Kiev in the Ukraine. And they talked about the idea that this script is going to kind of incorporate the current war in the Ukraine as an impetus for Drago and his son to permanently try to come to the U.S., kind of make it a little bit of an immigration story. Listen, I'm not a big spinoff guy, and I am notorious, and I call myself out on it, and I admit it. When they announced Creed, I thought it was one of the stupidest ideas I ever heard. You want to do a Rocky movie where Rocky's not the main guy. And it's not even, like, the real Creed. It's the seed of Creed? You know, I, I thought <laughs> The it was seed of Creed! The seed of Creed! Creed seed! <laughs> Creed seed. That's another spinoff yeah. you could do. But I thought it was a stupid idea. And then I saw it. Well, then I found out that Ryan Coogler was directing it and Michael B. Jordan was in it. And then I saw it and I fell in love with it. Love the films, all that kind of stuff. And I got to say, although the screen time is limited, I was fascinated by the story of Drago and his son. Like even just the character without dialogue, the character work that was happening during that big final fight where Drago himself is like, my son is more important to me than my vendettas, than my beefs, than whatever perceived glory or wrongs, and he throws in the towel to protect his son. Like, that was a massive story arc for a character. And the idea of having a Creed-like movie, but about them, because, you know, in Creed 3, at the beginning of it, they were kind of setting up that Drago was going to be the next guy. The young Drago was going to be the next champion. He was going to kind of take that over. I mean, he he beat the hell out of Creed <laughs> earlier. So guys, we want to take a second to thank a sponsor of this video, Mint Mobile. On average, it takes about 30 days for a person to break their New Year's resolution. So if saving money was on your 2024 list, your odds aren't looking that great. Luckily, I have a 100% guaranteed way to save you money this year. Just switch to Mint Mobile. For a limited time, wireless plans from Mint Mobile are $15 a month when you purchase a three-month plan. That's unlimited talk, text, and data for 15 bucks a month. I've told you guys many times that after switching to Mint Mobile, I am spending less than a third on my cell bill than I used to with a major carrier. Say goodbye to your overpriced wireless plans, jaw-dropping monthly bills, and unexpected overages. All Mint plans come with unlimited talk and text, plus high-speed data delivered on the nation's largest 5G network. And don't worry about having to change phones or numbers. Use your own phone with any Mint Mobile plan and bring your phone number along with all your existing contacts. So guys, to get this new customer offer and your new three-month unlimited wireless plan for just 15 bucks a month, go to mintmobile.com slash cam. That's mintmobile.com slash campia. Cut your wireless bills to 15 bucks a month at mintmobile.com slash campia. Additional taxes, fees, and restrictions apply. See Mint Mobile for details. I got to tell you what, I don't think this is going to happen. All right? Let me, let me go on record. I don't think this is going to happen. But mark me down as being interested in this. I think this could be an interesting story. Anyway, Rob, you read this. What do you think? 
Well, like you, I, I, first of all, who doesn't like Dolph Lundgren? <laughs> you know, he's he's actually a very intelligent, very educated. Doesn't he have like three master's degrees yeah. or something like yeah. that? Yeah, and he's got a great, I think he's got a great screen presence. I like the way he looks. I like the sound of his voice. And the fact that I think Ro Rocky Four is my second Behind Rocky Five, it's my least favorite what, Rocky movie. Oh, I love Rocky Four. But mm -hmm. uh, you know, it's I just it was too much of You're it right. was too montagey and yeah, it didn't yeah. give it didn't give me what I, like I liked. It was a product of the era that the movie yes, was made. Yes. But I liked his character. You know, I like what he represented. And I think, look, once you've made Creed work three times, doing a Drago movie and adding depth and adding um character development a father-son story make it an immigration story all of these things are are ripe to explore as far as drama goes and as far as you know the rocky movies are concerned it's amazing that the rocky franchise is still continuing six rocky movies three creed movies this might be the 10th movie in the franchise for rocky i mean it's crazy but i like the idea and why not if it's good look if it's good i'll watch it and this like you, I, I was dubious about Creed, but I really liked Creed. I thought it was a terrific movie. But if they do this, whether they do Creed 4 or do this Drago movie, someone's going to have to still explain to me how Apollo Creed's wife died and Rocky didn't bother to show up to their funeral. I mean, that, someone's still going to have to explain he, that to me. He, like, even, I know you could get Sylvester Stallone there. Have a body double with the camera from behind wearing the classic hat that that uh you know rocky I, I just thought that was really weird that was one of the weirder moments of the movie for yeah me. he probably didn't get directions to it so, <laughs> he, um, get directions. he was like just a, off camera Joe. so uh rob i need to ask you something so you represent murder and drug use because that's what drago did in rocky four okay i murder understand he was, he I was it wasn't I, murder it, it was in murder the ring in the ring come on he murdered he should he have been doping. He should on. have been doping, but that was because the Soviets were still the evil empire, which mm -hmm. they're turning back into. Oh, yeah, they were making the him do that, right? That, that, do you guys see that being a problem well, right now with what's going Drugs on? Drugs and murder? Overseas, no, not at all. Like <laughs> Russia and things, like uh, making a movie. That... Well, I, I think that could make it interesting because you don't make it about the geopolitical issue. Right, right, right. You make it about the personal story of somebody escaping yeah. that. Here's, right? yeah. yeah. Here's my problem with the film. Dr his son, who are you going to get? that's believable that could beat this kid this guy yeah. is a mountain of muscle i know in the real in real boxing muscle doesn't mean anything actually it's actually not good for you most of the time um but in the rocky world drago's punches changes lives if, if, <laughs> if, if, if creed that. goes if creed goes on if we get creed 5 where he gets older the reason why if he goes dumb it's gonna be because of uh, the the beating drago drago on. not 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 uh, not Dame, what's his name damien the guy yeah. Jonathan Majors play, not the first guy he fought. It's going to be because of Drago. So who are they going to get that's going to actually look like a a good fight with, with Drago? Nobody. There's you. nobody. Yeah, Ray, at the gym, Ray. No, this guy is a big rock of muscle. I mean, he, I, he's a and I like seeing this guy on screen. I yeah. really, whether it was in Shang-Chi or this, and I hope he gets more stuff. Yeah. Hey, guys, thanks so much for watching this video. Make sure you like the video, leave a comment and subscribe to our channel. And don't forget, we have a daily podcast called the John Campy Show podcast available on Apple Podcasts, Spotify or your favorite podcasting app of choice. Go and subscribe to it today so it'll be there when you need it.